What are the pillars of creation? The pillars of creation are famous astronomical objects located in the constellation Orion. They are a region of gas and dust within the Eagle Nebula, also known as M16, located about 7,000 light years from Earth. The pillars are so named because they resemble columns of gas and dust and are believed to be forming new stars. Big columns of bright gas and dust and making new stars constantly? What is there not to like about the pillars of creation? Keep to the end of the video if you wish to know all about these magnificent creations of the universe and what possible future it might have in store for us all. The pillars of creation creation are a beautiful and fascinating example of the processes of star formation and have been studied by astronomers for many years. They are formed by the collapse of molecular clouds, which are vast clouds of gas and dust in the interstellar medium. As these clouds collapse under their own gravity, they begin to form new stars. The pillars of creation are thought to be in the early stages of this process, with newborn stars beginning to form within the clouds of gas and dust. The pillars of creation were famously imaged by the Hubble Space Telescope in 1995 and the image became one of the most iconic and widely recognized images in all of astronomy. The image was taken in visible and infrared light and shows the pillars in great detail with swirling clouds of gas and dust, newborn stars and other features visible. It is important to note that the pillars of creation continue to be a popular subject of study and and fascination for astronomers as they continue to unravel the mysteries hidden inside it and the general public alike. The pillars of creation are located in the Eagle Nebula, which is a region of intense star formation. The nebula is a vast cloud of gas and dust and is home to many newborn stars. The pillars of creation are a small part of this cloud but have become famous due to their striking appearance and the fact that they are are believed to be in the early stages of star formation. The pillars of creation are made up of cold molecular hydrogen gas, dust and other materials. They are about 5 light years tall and are thought to be about 7,000 years old. The pillars are being sculpted by the intense radiation and winds from nearby newborn stars, which are causing the gas and dust to evaporate and disperse. This process is known as photo evaporation and is thought to be a key mechanism in the formation of new stars. The pillars of creation have been studied in great detail by astronomers using a variety of telescopes including the Hubble Space Telescope, the Chandra X-ray Observatory and the Spitzer Space Telescope. These telescopes have allowed astronomers to study the pillars in different wavelengths of light, providing a more complete picture of their structure and the processes taking place within them. This can help to determine how the new stars are going to be formed and also determine their trajectory line in the universe. In addition to their scientific importance, the pillars of creation have also captured the imagination of the general public and have become an iconic image in popular culture. They are a beautiful and awe-inspiring example of the majesty of the universe and a reminder of the vastness and complexity of the cosmos. The future prospects for the pillars of creation are difficult to predict with certainty as they are affected by a variety of complex processes that are not fully understood. However, based on different knowledge and observations, it is thought that the pillars will continue to evolve and change over time. The pillars of creation are currently in the early stages of star formation, with newborn stars beginning to form within the class of gas and dust. As these stars grow and mature, they will continue to to influence the structure and evolution of the pillars. The intense radiation and winds from the newborn stars will continue to evaporate and disperse the gas and dust within the pillars, sculpting their appearance and influencing their ultimate fate. It is possible that the pillars of creation will eventually dissipate entirely as the gas and dust within them are blown away by the winds and radiation from the newborn stars. All 
Alternatively, the pillars may survive and continue to evolve over time, potentially giving rise to new generations of stars. Ultimately, the future of the pillars of creation will depend on the complex interplay of various physical and chemical processes and will be influenced by factors such as the mass and luminosity of the newborn stars, the density and distribution of the gas and dust within the pillars, and their overall conditions within the Eagle Nebula. What do you think about these amazing creations in the vastness of space? Let us know in the comments down below.